Stephen Lott is my name and I live here in Derntorn, uh, Carberry County Kildare. I'm married and we have one son and um, we do a bit of part-time farming here and I also work for UCD as a Chief Livestock Supervisor. Well, we go back to, it go back to the summer of 1988 and I went to my GP who immediately transferred me to St Vincent's Hospital under the care of Professor Muldowney who immediately diagnosed me with members nephropathy. So subsequently I suppose I spent the next three years in and out of St Vincent Hospital. At this stage I have had three kidney transplants. It's very unlikely that I'm going to be put forward for a fourth one. And you know something, that's okay. I don't mind, I'm very happy with the regime I have. My ultimate goal is just to stay healthy, stay on the regime that I am, and this regime is improving the whole time. So the standard of health that I'm achieving now, the standard of life I have is quite good. I do every second night, eight hours session. Now for the first for the first 12 months it wasn't all plain sailing in that I found it very very difficult to sleep and my wife found it very difficult to sleep but over time it just gradually got better and I gradually was able to sleep and I'm at the stage now that when I get up in the morning time after having a night session on the ass I actually feel refreshed and much better. The standard of health that you have with the nocturnal dialysis is much improved over the hospital dialysis. Secondly, the, the amount of time that you have to spend with your family and, and, and friends is much improved as opposed to traveling up and down. When you're traveling up to Beaumont Hospital for four hours dialysis, that is a long, slow four hours. But with the current regime, you don't have time to think about that. And the fact that you go on it at night time and you're sleeping through it, it's, it's, it's not a great concern. I am four and a half years now on, not, on home dialysis and in that four and a half years I have never been hospitalised once. I am on no blood pressure medication. Previous to that when I was on the dialysis in the hospital my blood pressure was through the roof and I could be on three and four different types of medication. Um, no phosphate binders and basically the level of medication that I am at the moment is a very low level, basically just minerals and vitamin supplements. Plus also the lifestyle I have. My son is he's mad into football. So during the summer evenings, we go football training every Thursday evening and we have a match every Saturday and some Sundays. When I was traveling up, and, if I was traveling up and down to the hospital, I probably wouldn't be able to do that. And I would be leaving, I would be missing out on the best years of his life. And you know, if longevity, if I can get an extra 10, 15, 20 years out of life, that's most important. You must always have the attitude that dialysis is not going to rule my life and you must be determined to work around it, certainly it is an obstacle but you can work around it and you must never ever let it get the better of you.